hello there welcome back to Marcus kitchen tv if you're new here you're very welcome so in today's video i'll be sharing with you guys how i made this delicious egg rolls so if you want to see how i made this stay tuned and keep on watching let's get started you'll be needing some eggs so in here i have seven large eggs so it depends on how many egg rolls you want to make for your family or for yourself so I'll make sure to add in some water and just make sure the water covers the eggs allow this to cook for 15 minutes guys 15 to 20 minutes maximum so we'll be back in 15 20 minutes guys it's 20 minutes already our eggs are properly cooked so what I'll do now is to switch off the flame and I'll be showing you guys how I stop my egg cooking process so into a clean bowl just make sure to add in some water and some ice cube and just gently drop in the eggs allow this to sit for three minutes but in three minutes time you come and we'll peel it off it's kind of different when you just pour in your cold water at the end of the day you have some eggs that the bags are peeled and you will not just like it so just allow this to sit for three minutes and we'll be back to peel our egg It's time for us to peel off the eggs so can you guys see how easy this looks so that is just it if you want to try your egg roll just make sure to follow this do process it don't take much of your time but at least you get a very perfect result at the end of the day When you are done peeling off all the eggs, just make sure to use your paper towel to remove some moisture from the egg. So we are done with that. So in it's time for us now to measure out our floor. So if you don't have measuring cup, you can also use your scale. So I'll be measuring out three cups of floor. That is just what I'm using. And I'll make sure two tablespoons of sugar. And I'll make sure to leave the list to everything I use in this recipe in the description box below. And I'll make sure to add in half tablespoon of nutmeg. And to that I'll be adding in one tablespoon of baking powder. And one tablespoon of powdered milk. Gently mix this together until all the dried ingredients is completely incorporated. adding your unsalted butter so just make sure to add in your butter and in there I have 50 grams of butter I'll gently massage this in until it forms a crumb like texture when you are done mixing this is how it should look so to that I'll make sure to create a hole at the center adding my one large egg and to that i'll be using in half cup of water i will be going in with half cup of water so just make sure you're adding your water bit by bit and mix this together until you get your perfect consistency please do not add in all the water in at once because it might ruin your dough just make sure to mix this very gently but i used so guys in total i used 200 ml of water so guys just gently mix this together very well it's already coming together pretty well so that is just it mix this very well until you get what you are looking for so and this is perfect for me i'm just trying to bring them together you don't have to knead your dough guys so just make sure to cover this up with a plastic wrap very well just cover it up very well allow this to rest for 10 minutes i always allow my egg roll dough to rest for 10 minutes so that is just it so we'll be back in 10 minutes time so guys it's 10 minutes already i'll make sure to remove the plastic wrap and cut this dough into seven equal parts so but i have more than seven here i think i should have boiled eight eggs but it doesn't mean so what i will do now is to make sure to cut them very well and if i have some leftover i will join them to float to rub on your palm take one of the dough make sure you flatten it out very well so can you guys see what i'm doing here 
just make sure to flatten it up very well and after that placing your egg in the center and gently seal it up and please do not forget to seal it up very tightly because it might bust open in the oil but you guys no matter what you did to egg grow egg grow must be egg grow it's one stubborn snacks guys so that is just it just make sure to cover it up very well so can you guys see what i'm doing here so just cover it up very very well so it won't bust open so you guys we are done so we'll set this aside so I'll be repeating the same step in case you did not see what I did. So that is just it. Just make sure to follow this step. You get a very perfect and tasty egg roll. So guys, while you are rolling out all your egg rolls, just make sure you started preheating your oil. Allow the oil to be very hot and you reduce the heat. That is just it because if you increase the heat when you just drop in the egg rolls it will just turn to brown completely brown without cooking through on the inside so and see if the oil is very hot so this oil is very hot i'll just make sure to add in my egg rolls bit by bit and fry this on medium heat please do not fry on high heat so it can cook properly on the inside so that is just what i'm doing here my egg roll. our egg rolls has been frying for some time now so we'll allow this to fry for a little longer and just take it out of the oil when it's properly cooked guys so you guys it's properly cooked now can you guys see this I don't know my camera is not doing justice to this but it's properly cooked it came out beautifully well so that is it this is the final look of our egg rolls we did a great job guys we did it again i thank you guys so so much for watching for always stopping by to support me i really do appreciate so please make sure to share this video to your friends your family and your loved ones and please do not forget to subscribe for more interesting and fun video see you guys on my next video i love you all bye bye see you soon